my channel for Mother's Bee Build and today we're building in Evergreen Harbour and I am having so much fun discovering the little locks now that are available to build in and I came across this lock called Canal Corner and it's a 20 by 15 lock and I was inspired by the houses around the whole neighbourhood and I wanted to build a family home that was a bit different and more modernised so when I was thinking about this lot I was thinking about you know urban living but being eco-friendly as well and I think I was able to capture that idea within this build so the exterior of the house does look very modern I used again the eco lifestyle wallpaper the wood wallpaper and I went for two color swatches and I really like the exterior and the interior well the interior is my favorite part of the whole build yeah so this house is called a narrow house because it is quite narrow in that sense and I wanted to have more bedrooms than two so I built three floors well you've got the basement the ground floor and you've got the upper floor and I think the basement area is such a cool area because it's hidden again and it's a little nice touch to the house so when you do enter this house you've got like a really nice foyer then you come across this wall and behind the wall is a bathroom I thought it would be like a nice way to break up the whole living space area the kitchen is pretty small but I think it's just what you need for this type of house and I really like the giant doors that come with this pack the well the glass doors I think they add such a nice touch to a home it makes the home much more brighter and uh, more modernized and I really like that feature because you can look into the garden and you can really take in evergreen harbors beauty and surrounding neighborhood so what I did with the ground floor I wanted to have a kitchen dining area I wanted to put a formal living area so there's no TV in the formal areas you've got the nice fireplace and the shelves and artwork and I think it's like nice place to entertain just a really nice chilled living area and you do have an entertainment room downstairs in the basement and I think that's like such a nice touch for the sims living there because you've got that own private area you don't have the random sim just walking in whilst you're watching tv so when you do go upstairs there's two bedrooms and a bathroom and I do include the laundry element into this build you can take it out if you want to but I think it fits with the whole eco lifestyle because I do put a clothesline at the back of the garden and I really enjoyed building this house it, it was fun building this house because it's so modern and I get to play with different colors and make it bright and make it feel like those homes that you actually see on tv or those showcase homes so I really like this house and how it turned out one of the funniest things happened to me when I finished this build so once I do finish my builds I do take screenshots of the house and take videos of the house and when I was taking a video of the exterior my sim actually managed to catch herself on fire and then proceeded to burn down the whole kitchen in his mouth a few seconds and <laughs> I didn't realize it was happening because I was in the camera mode so I couldn't see what my sim was doing and I just left her alone for a couple of seconds and she managed to catch the whole kitchen on fire so I am enjoying the elements of more fires and the firemen but it kind of gets a bit annoying once in a while when you're trying to take a picture and she just catches everything on fire but I really am enjoying this pack though and the new updates and everything along with it so guys if you like this house tell me what you like about this house and tell me if you have any ideas or suggestions for me to build and I'll be really interested in getting more ideas to build things so this house can be downloaded you can find the download link in the description bar below and if you really like this house give this house a thumbs up subscribe to me and comment as well and until next time take care